Hey gang, I know you've been watching and waiting for my uh, newest videos to come out and I don't want to disappoint you so I decided I'm going to make a video on cutting up what's left of this 66 Mustang Coupe that I use as parts uh, for the Brooklyn Pony. There are some pieces I will salvage out of this but for the most part it's all going away and I have some other scrap metal I need to get rid of and I just decided I was tired of walking around this thing and it needed to go. So I'm going to use my handy dandy Harbor Freight plasma cutter and cut this thing up into pieces, throw it on the back of Franken truck and haul it out of here. So let's get started. take a minute to show you some things this is the, the car that um, another YouTube follower had started with him and his son and they found out that the uh, car had been rear-ended and I pointed this out before in another video where the frame rails are collapsed um, the inner structure is all pushed forward you can see this the distortion in those shock holes shock mount holes and how somebody had pieced this thing together you know in order to hide it or hide the truth from somebody you know from them or whoever was going to buy it but I wanted to point these things out this uh, trunk panel isn't welded to the frame it had one little weld right there there's nothing attached here this is a patch that's cut out of another car you can see let me show you from the other side that's, that's the flange where it's not even attached you know just people doing shady work to cars and then trying to pawn them off on somebody else but this really lets you see it um, the quarter panel wasn't welded at all up there where it wraps into the quarter window the only point of the uh, attachment from the flange to the outer wheelhouse was like a spot right here 
nothing else was welded at all there's a few little sketchy welds here on the bottom you know just frustrates me when I see that what people are doing in these cars and then like I said handing them off to somebody else and saying good luck so I'll show more as I get it further cut apart You can see exactly what I was talking about. Absolutely no welds holding it to the frame rail at all. You can see where it was rubbing. The uh, only places that were holding was this front corner, this lower section. You can see, hopefully, you can see that little spot right there. Get the get this uh, panel out of the way so really nothing holding that on the car and, and now you can see the condition of the frame rails I can't believe that somebody tried to hand this off to somebody else look at that hopefully you can see that got a reflection on the camera so I can't really tell but that whole thing is collapsed. It's even got a light coming through it. Unbelievable. Yeah. I don't care. There's just no way that frame rail should even move like that. You can see the collapse point. Right Yes, I think I'll hang on to that roof structure for a little while anyway. This gives you an idea of what's inside. If you look, there's several inner bracing pieces that go into this roof. You can see this piece here. Is there's you know multiple layers and not counting the inner structure, so it gives you an idea kind of what's in the roof. So I'm gonna keep on cutting and get this down to smaller pieces so I can get it out of here.
Well, that's one way to get rid of it. As you can see, as I was cutting away little pieces and clips and different things that I may find useful later on, um, not much else to save. So, this is going to go get scrapped. It served its purpose, unfortunately. Can't save everything. And, uh, yep, it's going to go away now. Hey gang, I know you've been following along on all my other videos. I said I decided I need to. Hey gang, I know you've been following following along. Hey gang, I know you've been following along on all my other videos with the Mustangs and different things, but I need to haul it off and get it out of here. And in or and the easiest way to do that is to cut it up. So I'm going to use the Harbor Freight plasma cutter and make this big 